Oh, hey guys, Phil Fenter. Right, today I want to show you something I've kind of been, not, I won't say, I've been working on it for roughly probably about a week and a half, maybe two weeks. And it's something what, to me, is going to work better for me. I know a lot of people gonna, might say something about it, do apologise about that. But yeah, and that is this. This is my bo one of my bottle pouches. I do have three, and I'm not being rude. Yes, I do have three. I have two on my belt, and I have this one here. This one here lives inside of my rucksack, and it's my um. What well, I just grab it. If I need to grab it, I can grab it. And if I want to walk around camp with something on, I can use this. Looks like, like using this. But I found the molly clips at the back were too cumbersome. It used to just hang like that off my belt and I just didn't like it. I found it really uncomfortable. Even with it all mollied in to, to the back pieces, into the little straps there, I just found it really still really uncomfortable. So then I went along and put a massive 100 feet of power cord loop, like this one, on it. And I found that took up a lot of room and space in my rucksack. So now I've took the 100 feet of power cord off, as you can see. This is nowhere near 100 feet, this is probably about 25 feet, something like that. 25 to, yeah, I reckon maybe 25 feet, even, maybe not even that, I don't know. To the truth, guys, didn't really measure it. But now I've put, took the two D-rings off and added two clips or two buckles. And that takes up less room in my rucksack and I can grab it, pull it out and then we go. But the other piece, yeah, is attached to my rucksack now. What I like that it's not taking up any space, it's not in the way, Don't get, it's not going to get caught on anything and I can still grab this one out of my rucksack, still be able to use this one if I want it around camp because I just got to take this one off and then put the other one on. And I'm going to cut here for the minute guys, because up here, show you this next clip quickly of me we're showing you where it is and then I'll bring you back where we're sat here now. Okay guys, see you in a bit. Right guys, as I was saying, it attaches onto the rucksack like this, as you can see there's the clip, it's a lockable one as well. Yeah. And it goes up, and it goes around the front. And then it goes back down this end on another clip. So when I need it, I can take that off, pull my back, back bottle pouch out, take that, take that off, take the um, handle off the bottle pouch, clip that on. So, right. Let me bring you back and I'll see you in a sec. Hey okay, guys, so as you can see that clip, yeah? I will now take that off. The rucksack, as you can just see, there is the rucksack there. Let me just read you. There's the rucksack there. Yeah. And now, this is my shoulder strap. Or this bottle pouch and it's on done don't have to wipe on it I'll stand up for you see easy as that yeah and then when I'm finished with it and I'm about to leave it's go back to cut and um, go back um finish up I'll put this one back on put this one back on the rucksack Put this one back on, put the bottle bag back, put this pouch back into the rucksack, and then yeah. And um, so yeah, that's what I've been working on the last two weeks. I know it's nothing special, I know a lot of people are going to say, well, yeah. And I know I don't need the cordage, I understand that, I get that. But I just got, like, I was using this at one stage as well. And that's just a one type use item just for this bottle pouch, just for the bottle pouch. I just thought, no, don't want it anymore. I've had enough of it. So I thought I'd put the power cord on. Didn't make a power cord because it was taking too much space in the rucksack. So then I had to redo it, really think about it. And then I came up with this idea and they lock 
they're not going to come undone. Yeah, and at the end of the day, yes, I know it's a lot of power cord. Yes, I get that. I understand that. But 100 feet of power cord, guys, weighs 132, 139 grams, I think it was, if I remember rightly. I really can't remember, but that's the number I've got in my head. So I do apologise for that. So, yeah. So, that's what I've been working on. As well as the fire stuff. So, tell me what you think. Tell me if you would, if what if you think this is a good idea or you think this is a crazy idea. Please be honest, because at the end of the day, I need some people to be honest with me. So, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.